Hundreds of cannabis cultivators in San Luis Obispo County face an uncertain future. The County Board of Supervisors met today to discuss a permanent marijuana ordinance. KSBY News reporter Angel Russell joins us now live at that meeting. Angel, did supervisors reach a decision? Karina, the County Board of Supervisors did not make a decision because public comment went all the way up to that 5 o'clock deadline, and it seemed pretty even on the amount of people who spoke. Half of them want to see them limit the amount of pot grows here in the county, but the other half is really urging county supervisors not to do that. Supervisors are deliberating whether to adopt a permanent cannabis cultivation ordinance. Planning commissioners have recommended supervisors place a cap on just how many there can be. Now, supervisors accept the recommendations. It would limit the number of cultivators to 50 and prohibit all grows on the Carrizo Plain, which includes California Valley. Well, right now there are 331 approved cultivation sites and most of those are in California Valley. If adopted, this ordinance would force hundreds of cultivators to shut their grows here in the county, which some want to see happen, but others are fighting against. This is unacceptable, supervisors. Think about what you would like, the smell coming into your windows. Don't kid yourselves, the farmers and pot growers are not paying for this. It's the people who live close. We could become a hub for craft cannabis tourism, just like we are for wine, but forcing cultivation indoors by limiting outdoor cultivation to 50 sites would not support the Appalachian model and would preclude Slow County from the economic benefit that a craft cannabis tourism market could bring. Now, if this ordinance is approved, all growers would need to apply for a new permit, and that would only be 50 spots open, which means it would be a highly competitive process. The County Board of Supervisors have decided to continue discussions on this ordinance on October 17th. They are allowing additional people to speak, but they are also hoping to come up with a final decision. Live and local in San Luis Obispo, I'm Angel Russell for KSBY News. All right, Angel, thank you. The county has a goal to establish a permanent marijuana ordinance before the state allows its own cultivation permits in January under Prop 64.